Okay, just to clarify, one way of setting an SRT line for the ascent and then converting over to DDRT, assuming you have set from the ground a ring-to-ring -ring friction saver, this represents my SRT line. When I'm on the ground, I pull up my SRT line. On the SRT line, or on that climbing line, I have an alpine butterfly. It's backed up with an anchor knot on a carabiner. So that goes up and locks into the small ring of the ring-to-ring -ring friction saver. And again, this is, this is my ascent line right here. I usually put a alpine butterfly or whatever, but it's very easy to tell. But that's, that's my ascent line. Once I reach my tie-in point, the first thing I'll do is take and connect my DDRT system to my, I'll connect this to my saddle. That way I know I can never drop the climbing line. Once that's connected to my saddle, I take this off, it goes to my saddle. And now that these are connected to the saddle, all I have to do is disconnect these knots. Pull the climbing line, let the climbing line go. If you want the tail for something, it's never. And again, this is this is all still connected to my saddle. Now I just run this through the ring, the ring friction saver. Reinstall the carabiner. And that's connected to my saddle. And I have my DDRT system ready to work. Okay, so from the ground I've set a ring-to-ring -ring friction saver. And I have my DDRT climbing system ready to go. An alpine butterfly that when I pull it up, it's going to lock into the small ring side of the ring-to-ring -ring friction saver and also put my climbing system in position so it's ready to go and I don't have to tie it when I get up there. I'll climb SRT on climb SRT on this line up to the ring-to-ring -ring friction saver. All right, so there is the system. There's the Kong duct, part of a life support connection. My hand ascender with a carabiner connected with the tether. I've wrapped the tether with some shrink tubing to help keep it oriented, as there will be some flop as I'm walking up the rope. And I have a Bates foot loop adjustable. You could make one out of cordage or something else. But this will be my SRT system on the ascent. I've put keepers on both sides of the Kong duct to keep it oriented on my saddle as well. My neck elastic to tend the duct. You may be tempted to connect to the small tether. I wouldn't do that because when that's lifted up, it would prevent the duck from engaging. Not sure if I'm walking, I have the foot ascender. I have my foot loop. So as I'm walking up the rope, this will keep my duck um, in position.
here's my tie in point. Now I can switch my system over to DDRT. Okay, so I've taken the Kong duck, stowed that, my foot loop, and my hand ascender converted over to a DDRT.